Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'm trying out a handmade, ethical, sustainable, independent clothing brand called Lucy and Yak. I want this to be like a series on my channel because I'm so guilty of supporting fast fashion just because of the prices obviously. So I want to start looking for more affordable, ethical brands to try instead of continuing to support fast fashion. So I kind of took everything out of the packaging because I know it's annoying when I'm like ripping at packaging and talking, talking, but the bags that each individual piece came in, they are biodegradable and then the rest came in uh, paper packaging. And they packed everything in this uh, super cute reusable bag as well. Okay, so I really wanted to pull this one out first. This is the Kathy Organic Corduroy Jacket in Prism Pink. And I only got it in a small because all the reviews said that they were really, really oversized. And it actually looks pretty big for a small. And I'm obsessed with the color. I'm obsessed with this, like, um, velvety material. I've been seeing a lot of people wearing it lately, and I think it's super cute. And this was only $78, which I think is really fair for a jacket. Like, I feel like no matter where you go, if you're getting a jacket, like, it's gonna be in that price range anyway so that's not overly expensive obviously i'm only going off of first impressions right now but this feels like really nice quality and really well put together like it feels like it'll last and honestly i think that the material looks like really expensive so i guess i'll try it on and see what i think of it hi the jacket is on and i absolutely love it i 100 percent recommend this jacket even if that's the only thing you get from the site well i haven't tried everything else yet but honestly i just love this so much it's actually really warm it's a lot warmer than i expected i really like the material of it it feels really good quality and i love the way it looks like i feel like it just looks like expensive and nice and it's definitely oversized which i'm really happy about i was so nervous because i would never buy a jacket for it not to be oversized but even if i was gonna do that i would never be a small like i'm always at least a medium so i was really worried but everyone was saying to go for a small and yeah definitely get a small unless you want it like really big or obviously if you're a bigger size but if you're more my body type I would say definitely go for a small because it's really big and it just like fits so comfortably and so perfect on me but honestly that's one thing that was perfect about the site is they had a whole bunch of different models of different body types and it would tell you what size each of them were wearing so then you could see how it fit people with your body type and if you wanted to size up or down you could see how it was going to look on your body type instead of always seeing the same body on every single clothing site which is really refreshing and it really helped me find my sizes too so yeah I'm really happy so far next item so next I have the Zola T in Evelyn print um this was a little bit more on the pricier side this one was $38 it's just a t-shirt but I'm like obsessed with the design and obsessed with the colors and I just thought it was so cute I had to buy it. I got this one in a size medium and it kind of it doesn't look like it's super cropped a lot of their tops were crop tops which I don't really like crop tops so I'm happy to see that this one is longer because I absolutely love it. It looks just like the picture and it feels really nice like it's like a thicker t-shirt material and it feels really really good quality. So here's the floral top. I actually love this so much. I love the little like mock neck but it's not like a full turtleneck I love the colors of it I feel like it's making my face a little bit brighter on camera I don't know maybe not I just feel like it is but anyway I love this I love how the flowers are like messy and like they're like colored outside the lines and they're not like perfect like I don't know I just think it's so pretty I love the colors I love the design I love everything about it I also liked how stretchy it was because I have eyelash extensions and I have this big fake ponytail on and the neck was like stretchy enough that I could pull it over my head easily without struggling so I really liked that I feel like anyone with eyelash extensions can appreciate shirts like that especially because it's got like this higher neck and I feel like these ones are always really stiff this one fits like absolutely perfect. I love how it's like loose in the shoulder and in the arm area. And I love that it's not like cropped cropped because it said that it was going to be cropped and I hate crop tops, but this one at least goes down to like my pant line. So at least it's not like cropped, it's like covering everything, but I'm also really short. I'm only five foot one, so it might be cropped for some people. So far, I've only tried on this in the jacket and I'm absolutely in love with both of them. And I think I could probably wear them together. Look at that. I can wear it together. I love that. I think that's cute. 
Okay, so this one is the Brady Mini Cross Body Pouch Bag in floral print. I absolutely love floral print. I don't know if you can tell. And I love colorful, like, rainbow floral print the best. So this site was perfect for me because I have a lot of that stuff. Um, so the bag is definitely bigger than I thought it looked in the picture. There are measurements on there, but I didn't read them until now. So I didn't know exactly how big it was going to be, but it looked tiny. But I think it would hold a little bit more than I expected. It has a little extra pocket in the back, too. And then I think that you could probably just fit like a small wallet, maybe your keys and your phone in here, and that's it. Maybe like a little snack in here. Like it's actually more roomy than I thought it would be. I actually like this one a lot, and they had like a lot of different like designs and colors on these ones, and it was $35 Canadian. Okay, so here's this one. This one was $28 Canadian. I got it in a medium, and it's the Greta Organic Cotton Crops Tea in Floral Check Pattern. Um, I, like, am obsessed with the design on this one. I really love flowers, you know, if you haven't noticed. And I thought this was really cute with, like, the plaid behind it. This one definitely feels really good quality. It has, like, the frillies on it, which I think that these little things, I don't even know what that's called. I don't know if it's, like, the lettuce hem if that's what this is, but I feel like this just adds so much to a shirt. I think it makes everything really, really cute. It feels really nice quality. This one is really, really soft. It feels the same as the first shirt that I tried, um, except for this one's like a little bit thinner and I feel like it's stretchier. So here's this one. I really like the design. I love this lettuce hem. I hope that's the right word <laughs> or that's going to be really embarrassing. But um, anyway, I like that the sleeves aren't too tight and everything, but I definitely think you should look at the sizing on each like individual item because the first shirt I found was that floral one and it was a medium and that was like my right size. I looked at all the models and then I just picked a medium for the other two tops that I got as well. And I think that I should have gotten a large in at least this one. I don't know about the green one yet, but yeah, I definitely think I should have sized up. So look at the sizing on each item. One thing I will say about these t-shirts is that they're not see-through whatsoever, any of them. And everyone is always like commenting on like more higher priced hauls, if that makes sense. And saying like, oh, I could get that same top from Rom Wee for $3. And it's like, sure you could, but you could probably see through it. Every top I've ever gotten from like Romwe or Sheen or anything like that has been so see-through, like any top like this. So I would definitely pay extra money for them not to be see-through. Also, I can definitely feel the difference between this and a cheaper top. Like I don't even know how to exactly explain it, but with all of these items, you can just like feel the difference. They definitely feel like they're going to last longer. They're just more comfortable overall i guess so yeah so i think this was the cheapest thing that i got this is the greta lettuce hem cropped tee in leaf green and this one is a lettuce hem shirt and it also has these little frilly things on it so i'm gonna say that that's what lettuce hem means so this one is really simple i don't really think there's too much to say about it it feels nice and soft but it's just a plain green shirt i've been obsessed with green lately i love it i think it looks good with my black hair so yeah, that's why I got this one. I guess I'll just try it on. I don't know what to say about it. Okay, guys, so I guess that's everything I have for you today. Before you order from there, I'm from Canada, um, Ontario. So basically, when I ordered from there, I got $50. It was like $55.50 worth of customs. So just to warn you, you probably will get those customs. Um, other than that, shipping was really fast to Canada. I got it in three business days. So that was really nice because this video was actually supposed to be a two brand video. I was going to try out two ethical brands that I found and compare them. But the other one like hasn't came yet. It was supposed to come on like December 2nd. And then it was supposed to come on December 9th, and that was yesterday. And now it says that it's coming tomorrow on December 11th. So I guess we'll see if it comes. But yeah, that video won't be coming out anytime soon because I only bought four things from there. So I'm going to have to go on and buy like four more things so I can do a full haul video or something. But yeah, this this their shipping was really fast from Lucy and Yak. So yeah, just the customs to watch out for. If I had any recommendations for you today... Um, Definitely check out the sizing on each item because I found that um, the very first one, I checked out the sizing and I was like, okay, I'm a medium. And then the other two t-shirts that I bought, I just picked a medium and I should have checked because I probably should have been a large in the second two t-shirts. So definitely look at the sizing of each item. And I definitely recommend the jacket. I'm so in love with the jacket. I recommend one of those little bags. It's really convenient, like really, really light. It doesn't feel like heavy on your shoulder at all which I don't know if that bugs anyone else but I hate heavy purses when I'm walking around I love that one and then also the floral top I love that I love that floral t-shirt it's so pretty 
obsessed. So yeah, I guess that's everything I have for you guys, and I will see you next time, hopefully. Bye!